Hello everyone and welcome to this brief video about how to create and upload podcasts using our Mixcloud system here in Clamars Community Radio. Now the first thing you're going to need before you do a podcast is obviously the recording of the show there and also a description of the contents of it which I'll show you. We have here we're going to do Eddie Sweeney's Money Matters show as our example here. Now the description should have perhaps a paragraph on the show, a little just introduction or a brief synopsis of what happened in the programme. In this case, Eddie's actually on holiday, so it's just a music show he's put up. So uh, it's a very short description, as you can see. Also there, we have the track list of the songs that are featured in the show. Now, you will need this later because Mixcloud.com, where we host the files, likes you to definitively say what music is in the show and even to pick the point along the length of the show where it occurs. I presume this is for rights reasons. We'll come to that in a second anyway. Before you upload something, it's probably a good idea to just check about cropping out the ads because I don't think the podcast listener needs to hear the ads. Now, the ads are part of the recording of the show because we generally get recordings off the logger or people record in the studio while doing the show. So what you do is open the file in the editor of your choice. You can use Adobe Audition or you can use <clears throat> Audacity, or you could use Cool Edit if you had that. I happen to have it open in uh, in Audacity here. There you can see the entire file, and all I've got left to do is I think I just have to crop out an ad which I've left down here. So I will do that, and then the show is ready for go. Now of course we have to ex save it if you're using um, uh, Audition, or in this case we're going to actually it's export is the command when you're using uh, Audacity. So I'm going to export that there. Uh, a word about bit rates. Generally, because it's going up for podcast, you don't make it a huge file. There's no need to make it a high quality file either. Not very high quality. So I think 128 is definitely the upper end of acceptable. In fact, I would say you don't need 128 if you're dealing with a music show or a show with a lot of music. A speech show could be as low as 64 kilobits and still be deemed acceptable for podcasting. Anyway, in this case, we do have a music show. We're going to save it as 128. So I'll just say save. You can go OK on that. And off it goes, it's saving. Okay, and we're done. So that's saved now, we can just close the file down. It's gone away. Now if we just look back here in our uh, folder, we'll see we have the description. We have the original file, which we'll say was the one that includes the ads and any other, was before any other edits. And then we have our podcast, which is now a 128 kilobit file in this case, and has the ads removed. Finally, the third, the final thing you need, not need it necessarily, but if you'd like to, is just a little image which describes your show. And again, in Eddie's case, it's this nice one of some money. Okay, so we're going to need that in a few minutes' time as well. So over here we go to Mixcloud.com. Now we will be giving out um, access to this to people who uh, want to use it. And if we go, this is our account. So if we just go to, there you see it's the Claire Morris FM account and it shows you all the recent podcasts that we have uploaded. So let's go ahead and upload another one. So we click on the upload link, which is the top middle of the page. There's a three step process uploading to mixcloud.com. The first stage, the first page is this one, which asks you to pick the file you want to upload. So we're going to go to desktop, the Money Matters folder, and there's the one called Pod that I've just finished. So we're going to select that. Secondly, it asks you to give it a unique name. Now that's easily done. If you just put in the name of your show with the date on which it was broadcast, you're going to have a unique name. I mean, you're not going to broadcast the show twice in the one day, are you? So that's a unique name there, Money Matters, 22nd of May, 2013. Click on Upload. Now it starts to upload. And you should see the progress bar kick into life now in a second or two. And there it is. Now they have a nice interface in the sense that you can do things while it's uploading. You don't have to stare at that bar for 10 minutes and just wait. So we can add in our list of songs, which we're going to do in a second. We can add in some tags, which allow people to search. We can add in the image we want to use as like a thumbnail of the program, which I showed to you earlier. And here's where we put our description. So let's go ahead and do this. Now, if you had a few songs, you could just put in artist and song one at a time 
click on add music track and then do it again. In the case of this particular show with Eddie, we have so many that we're actually just going to use copy and paste because we click on pre-written track list, we go up here to this box which appears, and we take our files, which you may notice I have just slightly edited to um, put a comma uh, between the title and the artist. We paste that in there. Now if we click on Go Magic, voila, we have the uh, details. Uh, you may actually notice they've gone backwards. Eddie just happens to have typed them in title and then artist, and they want artist and title that way. So there is actually an easy way of fixing that. Swap columns is there as a button. So if we click that, now we're right. So we have Solomon Burke and Don't Give Up On Me, Kings of Leon and Happy Alone. There you go. Perfect. Next thing is tags. So type in things that should do with the show. Money Matters is a one that we use for a dish show, so that's by default. We can say um, the name of this town there is Claremaris, Radio, Ireland. Just a few things. So if anyone's searching, they'll find it. Next thing is to add that uh, thumbnail. So there we go, moneymatters.jpg. And finally, the description. So I pop back over here to the file and we select that, copy and paste again, and put it there. And that's it. We just have to wait now for the upload to finish. And you can see it's on 78%. So we'll wind the clock on a few minutes and come back when it's done. Okay, so as you can see, we're on the verge now. Five, six seconds to go. If I scroll on the bottom, you'll notice as well the save button, which um, was actually kind of greyed out earlier, will now become clickable when you're finished. So we click on that, and that saves our details. Now the final section of the task is this one, where they ask you to say where each piece of music is. Just pause that for a second. Now the very first one actually says you can't move that. So let's go see where is Happy Alone by the Kings of Leon. We're on the way here somewhere. Just move that, drag it in place. It goes green to say it's locked in. And that's the job done for each song. Yeah, there it is, Kings of Leon, Happy Alone. Now again, this is sorry, this is a unique enough show that Eddie has just put in uh, on practically an entire show of music. So once again, I'll just leave you for a few seconds and I'll go and do these, spare you the uh, bother of listening to them all. So back in a tick. Okay, so we're back. I have now timestamped all the music, which basically means I've picked the exact spots where the songs were uh, placed in the uh, file, the hour music. Once we're done there, we go save. Now this page you can ignore, it's to encourage you to spend money, which we don't encourage you to do. However, you could, I suppose you could also share on your Facebook or share on your Twitter. And you can do that there. Presuming you're not going to do that, or you're not going to spend any money on it, let's click go to my cloudcast. And here it is, well done. You have updated, uploaded your own podcast, or cloudcast rather, to Mixcloud. And it is there and finished. You can grab either this link here in the test top bar, or you can grab this kind of shorter link that's very handy for Twitter. Copy that, paste it, spread it around, and promote it. Encourage your friends to come and listen to your show. It's as simple as that. You have done it. The job is over.